hello everyone this is asmr if today welcoming you to my new photoshop tutorial today i'll show you how to do the high-end retouch of the skin retouch like that professional skin retouch i think the sharpen and uh, today my close younger brother valentino gomez requested me to do uh, make uh, this type of tutorial uh, that's why i'm making this tutorial for him and for all those who are included or involved in a photography or fashion photography okay let's start how to do that okay i'm just uh, closing this file okay, i'll show you a totally new one okay at first go to the file then open i just open up this image this one is a stock image i downloaded from the deviantart.com and i'll give you this photo link on my video description for your practicing okay then i'll crop this one and crop ratio will be 16 is to 9 and just i just make it update this image okay and hit the tick button and press ctrl o for the full screen and then make a copy by pressing ctrl j okay at first i will apply the dodge and burn option you know uh, what is dodge and burn option the dodge and burn burn is a shadow area and the dodge is a highlighted area you can tell it okay i'm giving the demo then you will be clear about that okay i just at first i am giving this layer name the D layer and go to the blending mode in a skin and then press the right button go to the blending options and just slide it down like that which uh, the highlighted area will appear like that ignore the background because the background has some the highlighted area just consider the face okay after that here is a slider and press the alter button and hold it and click this button and it will be divided and just make it okay that's good and I hit ok button and just go to the background options and press ctrl J by uh, just uh, making another layer another copy of this layer and uh, i'm giving the name the burn option and i'm just making this burn layer to the front and blending option will be blending mode will be multiply and going to the blending options and again i will apply same things but this arrow button and just watch the shadow areas here is some shadow areas actually for that i'll just press again the alter button and press here it will divide and then just apply this one like that and you can give the okay okay i'm just reducing the opacity the hit the ok button and making the burn and dodge options in a group by pressing ctrl g ok and just mask this one after that go to the image option and apply image and everything will be zero and the normal options and hit ok i think this one is most um, uh, like uh, the previous one was uh, without the highlight and shadows and here is some shadows with the highlight okay that's good and after that i'll go to the eyes and the lips options and just i'm pressing the ctrl alter shift e or you can just make it the smart object convert to the smart object and then go to the filter then camera or filter after going there you should make it merge it will be better to make the smart object okay ctrl shift alter e and 
go to the filter camera raw filter after going camera raw filter i will increase the light of red okay the luminance i will increase and the saturation i'll decrease okay that's good the hit ok button and after that i will apply a filter or plugins for these uh, the pimples pimples that's why okay i'll go to the filter then the portrait filter and i'll apply the settings the sharpness will be the 40 percent and softness eight percent warm the minus one and then tint zero percent you can increase or decrease the tint but uh, i think tint shouldn't be touched okay after that the brightness okay what is the softness softness uh, the mm, soft area of the face the soft skin you you are watching here uh, the all the pimples dot just gone and after that the tint tint is how warm or how cool your face is your model face is the yellowish and the reddish in a word okay and the brightness you know the, the how highlighted and he highlighted this one okay like that okay the warm how the orange color and how the blue color bluish your image is okay plus one is good and the hit ok button i'll give you the uh, plugins download link in my video description don't forget to check it out and after that i'll go to the options and go to the color lookup options and apply the horror blue color and i'll give the fill color only 16 percent and i'll make a group of these two layers and make it merge and after that go to the filter and then the nick collection color effects pro after going to the color effects pro i will apply the cross processing filters here are lots of filters and i will apply the c4 filters you can choose anyone from uh, the filter gallery it's up to you and it's up to your choice and it's up to your model uh, categories all the things i'm to I mean, just selected the c04 and hit the ok button after hit the ok button i'll just do some the basic things which is the levels go to the levels and i'll just give some levels like that and add. okay hit ok button and making all the layers in a group and make it merge and after that i'll go to the filter and camera raw filter and add some the vignette okay and then add some amount of sharpness and the luminance also and hit the ok button okay let's see what was the previous or the raw image we have this one the raw image when you are shoot your models in a indoor or a outdoor uh, the image will be like that um, by using your strobe or camera light setup or umbrella setup and after that if you want to submit your photo to the professionals in a sector like uh, magazines or the facebook pages and others you know, the social media or print media then you have to do like that editing it could be the best thing for you hope that this tutorial will help you a lot and if if you have any kind of question on, or query for me or to me and then do comment on my video description or video comment section and if you want to get this type of amazing tutorial in future don't forget to subscribe my channel and the, hit the bell icon and don't forget to share with your friend okay till the next video i am asm arif signing out and bye bye